Hi everyone, so this is what I got Alistair for Christmas. He is three and a half, or over three and a half now. He will be four in May. Um, yeah, I think I've been quite good this year. Um, I can go a little bit overboard, but I've been quite reserved. I feel like I have anyway. Um, and also, I buy throughout the whole year. As soon as Christmas ends, like we've got a one week to Christmas, as soon as it ends in the January sales, I'll be buying more toys for the previous year. So I do buy way in advance. So I get good deals, um, always buying sales mainly. Um, I don't think I've paid full price for anything that I've got here. Um, what else should I say? Um, I've don I donated a lot of toys to Bernardo's just recently and to a newly new shop which is just local to me. Um, so yeah, I think I've done quite well. Yeah, so I'll start off with his stocking. So this is his stocking. It's just an old traditional stocking. Um, Violet's got the same, or near enough the same sort of design. So stocking presents, these are just little knickknacks, bits and bobs, you know, really cheap, nothing expensive in here. So the first thing I've got is this um, toothbrush. Um, it, it's an electrical toothbrush and I saw these in Morrison's. They were like half price, they were £2.50. You can kind of, um, it comes with like 141 stickers, you can stick stickers on it. And yeah, it's just a fun toothbrush and it was £2.50 and I thought it's just another fun thing for a stocking. Um, I then have this, um, this is from Lush, um, the shop called Lush, it's basically fun soap, you can mix it up with water and it sort of creates bubbles, they can play with it, it's like Play-Doh basically, um, and it's green and you can get them in all different colours, they're sort of really fun, um, you can wash with them, and yeah I thought this would be a great present for um, him and Violet really. Um, yeah, and this was £5. Um, Graham picked up a few little funny things. Like, um, so Halloween's just passed. He picked up this for him. Little spider key ring. He picked up this jelly light thing. These are all from Co-op, by the way. He picked up this alien egg thing. I remember having these as a child. Um, he got him these um, spiders in a coffin. And they were, those all, all those items were from co-op and they were basically just reduced Halloween stuff. I think they were about 20 to 50p each. So yeah, he loves stuff like that. Um, I also got this uh, tumbling wall bug for him. I got that from a uh, Hawkins Bazaar. Also I got this um, sunflower, basically um, plant your own sunflower seed in this little jar. And then obviously once it grows you can plant it outside. Little aeroplane duck. Um, fan. I got that from Hawkins Bazaar, I think. Uh, what else? And then at the bottom, just some little treats. He's got a Milka Santa Claus and he's got some chocolate coins. So that's in his stocking. So getting on to the toys. So I'm going to start with sort of the little bits. Colouring crayons and colouring pencils. Um, Alistair is so into drawing at the moment. And these were, I think they were half price in M&S. And yeah, I thought they were really good. They're jumbo size. And this one comes with like a colouring pad. I think they're a couple of pounds each. We've got this, um, when I, I go to Ikea all the time. And I noticed they had this wind up torch. And I thought this would be really fun for him. He just loves stuff like that. It's very boyish. Um, we have two action figures. He's very much into his action figures, and these are definitely these are two that he hasn't got. And I prefer to get him the miniature size ones because, like the previous years, I like last year I bought him the big Toy Story. He loves it, but it's massive, and he can't take it anywhere with him. So these are the perfect size to take with around, sort of in the car and stuff. I've got him the Hulk, and I've also got him the Iron Man. And these were half price in Toys R Us. I got these back in September, I think. This Dino Magic Egg, which basically you put it in water, fizzes up, and it just turns into one of these dinosaurs. This is from Tesco Home. I think it was about £3. He's very much into dressing up. I got him a builder's hat, says the boss on it, um, and a high-vis jacket. How cute is that? Um, and then I got him the um, Big Jigs wooden um, sort of belt with all the tools in and all these items were from Amazon and I spent no more than 
I think, £15 on all of it. I always get Christmas books for them, um, or should I say for Alistair, and this year he's got this one. Um, it's called Fly Freddy Fly, and I got this from Asda. It was only £3, and it's a really sweet Christmassy sort of book. Um, he's very much into Toy Story still, and we've never actually owned one Toy Story DVD. Um, we've always sort of recorded them on Sky, but so I just thought why don't I just buy the box set so I did and I love them myself We all love them and yeah, I got them for £12 And that's from HMV. Um, another thing I picked up which I thought was really cool I saw it on Amazon. It's called a creature peeper and you basically put bugs inside and you look through the telescope and you can also put water in there like water sort of bugs and I think he's gonna find that so much fun That's what it looks like um, yeah, and this was £4.50 from Amazon. I got him this Cars 2 watch. When I was in Toys R Us I saw it and I think it was £4 or £4.99. As a child I loved this game and I, I know this is something he will really like. He's very much into pirates. He loves games and yeah, so I got him the pop-up pirate. I got this from Amazon, it was only £7.50 which was a bargain. I've seen them all on Amazon. Um, and eBay selling for like £12 used or even higher than that and I managed to get this while it was reduced um, about a month ago so just recently um, yeah so uh, it's definitely a game that he can play thing I got him he's very much into drawing and I've showed these magic boards in my previous favourite so I got him a new one this is the sort of magnetic magic board this is a Toy Story version um, I think it's actually the panel comes off it's just um, just has the Toy Story sort of design around it. Um, yeah, and I think he's going to love it. It's a nice big size as well. And on to boring stuff. So I got him this cute t-shirt. This is from Gap. And I got it in the sale and I thought it was really sweet. PJs. Got to have some PJs on uh, Christmas. He's got these cute dinosaur ones. Um, they actually come in two, a set of two. Um, from Sainsbury's. And they come with like these nice thin long johns. Um, trousers and I got him at age five to six because he's very very long um, and they're really really thick really nice quality and they were on half price I think they were reduced to like seven pounds for two sets um, underwear he's got some underwear these were half price as well reduced to like two pounds 25 gotta have underwear and then I got him these cute uh, mini Bowden socks I think they're cute he's just gonna look at them as socks but they're just stripy socks his, oh no actually, not his last present, but this is um, his, I was saying previously I was going to make him a, a Tree Food Tom outfit, and I did make it in the end. So basically all I used was an old t-shirt, this is his t-shirt, it still fits him, because Tree Food Tom wears a blue t-shirt, and then he wears a sort of leaf over it. So this is the leaf, I sort of cut it out and then sort of drawn on it. So that's how well, the design on the leaf, he kind of, his head goes through it. And then it kind of wears a belt, and I made the belt myself as well, out of just quite strong felt. And the belt looks like this, and the only thing I need to do now is just put a button on there. And this is like a little um, sort of pouch where you can just rip off. And yeah, that's basically his little belt. Um, it's adjustable waist, and yeah. He also wears some gloves, and I basically just cut out the fingers, because that's what his gloves look like. And his last present, which is his big present, um, I was tempted to wait to get this for his birthday, but I just thought, while it's on sale, I just couldn't help myself. And this is the Leap Pad Explorer 2. Um, yeah, it's basically like a child's iPad, but not as such because they don't go on the internet or anything they basically just play games on it and I've already set it up for him you have to connect it to the computer you have to um, download a few things to install some stuff on it um, it already comes with quite a few free free games on it um, yeah it's very much into learning they can draw on it um, yeah I really like it um, I got this from Amazon their original price is usually £90 and they were selling them on Amazon for 60 so I was really pleased to get £30 off this. I got him a skin which is like a rubber skin to go on it so he doesn't sort of ruin it and scratch it up and I got him one game. This is Toy Story 3 game. Um, they're usually £20 and I got this again from Amazon for £13. 
I only got him one game because he's getting two games from my mum and one game from my sister. And they really don't need too many games, otherwise they won't enjoy them. So, yeah, this is everything I got Alistair. Like I said, I, you know, have been buying this stuff a lot over the past year. And, um, yeah, I think he's going to really like what he's got this year. And now I can finally, you know, get on and wrap these up because we've only got a week left to go. And I've been dying to film this video. Um, I will try and link everything down below, whether it's in sale or not. And yeah, if you've got any questions or comments, please let me know. And yeah, thanks for